pictures. In this video I'm just going to show you how you can use a gradient and a perspective warp to create a cone gradient. Great. So this is using Photoshop CC 2014 and I'm using the reflected option here, gradient tool. Now the gradient I'm using is one of the gradients from a graphic extras. You can find about 32,000 different gradients on that site and it's got transparency, that's the key thing. I've got a transparent background, got transparency here for the, the edges of the uh, gradient. So create that sort of design, black there, click OK. Now I'm going to hold the shift key down and I'm just going to apply it across. Okay, so you've actually got that design now, transparency at the side. What I want to do now is edit perspective warp. I really, really don't understand why that dialogue always keeps appearing. I just get, can't get rid of it. Anyway, what I want to do is just click there and go down there. Just so it's basically outside of the uh, that gradient. So give it a bit of a gap, and likewise, just go over here. Again, on the other side, basically the same sort of gap. Now go click the warp option. Now, within the warp, you can actually just drag those over, make them touch, touch, just touch a little bit of uh, right. Now that's dragged up the other one, of course. So you can just have to just drag that down a bit. And I'm just going to have to bring out Navigator so I can actually see the full extent of that. Okay, right, there you have it. You've got the cone design. Click OK. Zoom back in again. And now, of course, it's a layer, so I can actually just move that around, position it in different places. And of course, I could recolor it. I can also duplicate it, hold the Alt key down. And so on, so on. So I just can drag those across. I can group those, of course, merge those. So layer, merge layers. Like create multiple designs there. And now I can duplicate that. The great sort of mountain range, or I could flip it over and make a, a zigzag like design. Hope you found this tutorial of interest.